This is a question that's often getting asked. Why do I only get, for example, 5 megabits if I've bought the 10 megabits per second package? And others, the guys advertise on the brochures that they now do 10 megabits per second. And um, the only is really why I circle it is that if you're getting 5 megabits and you're advertised 10, you're actually doing extremely well. So don't complain about that one. You can get much less. And let me just explain why. And um, the guys advertise this one because everyone does it, so they won't compete with their competitors if they if it does something different. And that's what they call the raw rate. That's the actual bits that fly through the air. But those bits don't contain your data. There's lots of bits that need to be ended, added to the packages to address it, to buffer it, uh, some of the protocols to make sure that the right amount was sent. So we call that real data. That's the file that you want to get from YouTube and the raw data. So. Um, real data is encapsulated in other raw data, so you'll never, never get the actual raw data rate. And I would say 5 megabits of 10 is actually doing quite well. Um, the next point is that you only get 10 megabits if you actually use the full modulation scheme, as they call it, of the signal, which is only going to happen if the signal is very, very strong. So there's a natural thing in 3G and 4G communication that as the signal to noise gets weaker, it diverts to slower data rates in order to still be able to get through and because you can now only hear not so clearly. So you'll have to get a very, very strong tower outside antenna or something like that if you even want to get to that guy there or that tall guy there. Then contention. People think that that cellular data, you've also got like many channels that transmit this stuff to you, so if your neighbor uses you, you will just get another channel. That's untrue because of the bandwidth. Any one sector has only got that available. So clearly a number of people can do it because they're not simultaneous, but the moment there's other guys with you trying to use it, the cell phone now have to and dash up the data or share it between you. And clearly if the cell gets overloaded, you can see that it says 10 people simultaneous then the raw goes to 1 megabit per second and you only get half a megabit per second, unfortunately. And then, of course, the base station or the internet, you know, the base station data goes there across the fibers and things, and ultimately speaking to another server that sits located somewhere that hosts your web page, if any one of them are congested, often for the same reasons as this, then of course you also cannot get your max rates. So max rates really, um, you often get 10 times less uh, and you have to live with it. These are real things. Only one we can solve is perhaps giving a stronger signal.